Morning people, well, it's almost afternoon. So today me and Mohammed, where's Mohammed? Mohammed, where are you? Yeah, mate. Where is he? Can't see you. Can't see you. Oh, there he is. Mohammed and I are going on a little excursion today. Mohammed's got a small plot of land or like an allotment and um, he grows uh, local vegetables. So I'm going to go and have a look at how he grows them and what they look like. Because the other day we did uh, fufu, didn't we Mohammed? Oh God, here we go guys. <laughs> so Mohammed has got his, uh, what's that? Cutlass? Yeah. Yeah, and what's that Mohammed? Banchidria. Banchidria. It's like, uh, I don't know. Cassava, cassava sticks. sticks, yeah, cassava sticks. And what are you going to do with them? I will cut, it, I'll cut them in, in pieces. He's going to cut them into pieces and do what? And then put, it, put them in, in, the ground. in the ground. In the ground, okay. So shall we go? Which way are we passing? Yes, sir. Okay. So yeah, me and Mohammed today. Because I wasn't doing much today. So I thought, why not take advantage of this lovely sunshine? and uh yeah so this is my area oops sorry this is my area where i'm staying with my cousin and uh yeah so we're gonna go to the little plot of land hello, hello. hello. this is a little hello. corner shop hello. right next hello. to the house and there's a nice man here yeah, yeah. Okay. you don't mind if i film you do you okay. What's, do you speak English? Hey. Yeah, 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 yeah. You speak English. English. What's your name? Hi. Hi, what's your name? What's your name? My name is Edward Kwanza. Edward Kwanza. Yeah. And this is a little corner shop. And this is, is this your wife? Yes. Hello, I'm Mrs. I don't know how to say. Hi. I'm from London. You're from London? Yes. I'm oh. just doing a little bit of filming. I'm going with Mohammed because he's going to show me where they grow the banchi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah my, my this thing came, she too, she, she came from London. Oh, she came from, from London. Yeah. Oh, no, I'm from Sweden. Oh, oh right. Right. No, you don't have to take a photo. Yeah. Yeah. You don't, 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 don't want to be in it, okay? No, you want to ask me first. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> She's shy, she doesn't want to be in it. Yeah, So this is the little corner shop. So. Yeah. This is like where we buy all our little provisions. So you can you tell me about like how much things cost? Um, like for example, how much is eggs? The egg one for seven seven pesos. Seven pesos. Um, that's less than that's less than one city. So it's probably about twenty p. Yeah, twenty p. And then you have tin, tin mill. One. Three, three cities, cities three points. cities in in English money is just less than a pound. Yeah. Okay, so these so are like okay, us. My brother is in Britain. Your brother is um, in we Britain. Have a, uh, bread. Okay. How much is that? So that's like a small two loaf of bread. Two, two cities. Yeah. So that's like fifty p mm -hmm. almost. Mm -hmm. And then tin tomato. Tin mm -hmm. Two cities. Two cities, that's also like 50p. But that's quite um, a big tin yeah. of tomato. And this is what they use in Ghana for like soup is and it, stew. Is it open? Easy open, guys. So look, you don't even need a can opener. Africa's choice, good. So African products. And then what's this? This is like sardine. Sardine. Yeah, how much is this? This is... Three CDs. three CDs. So everything is like between 50p and one pound. And then we have some smaller I'm items here. What's this? Is this sugar? Sugar. So this is sugar. How and much is that? It's one CD. One CD as well. Half, 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 half yeah. packet. Yeah. Is this is this half a packet? Half a cup. Half a cup. Mm -hmm. So is this half a cup? Yeah. This is half a cup of sugar. Full one. Full pack of yeah. sugar. Yeah. So it's like tw okay. between 25 and 50p. Okay. And then we have soap. Yeah. 
soap, which is what we use to like wash clothes. And how much is that? Two CD as well. So yeah, okay, so less than two CD. So how is life in Ghana selling things? Is it difficult? Do you want to come in? Do you want to be in a video? No? <laughs> is that your son? So how is life in Ghana? Life in Ghana, a lot of people, this is for brick and cabal and this thing, for the, and all that thing. For the children. The children, most of them, they don't have money. They yeah, they don't have, they don't have a lot of buy. money, yeah, so okay. Some yeah, people they give them bean and carry. Yeah, like yeah, they that's. They have money to buy things for their small, small, small children. Small children, yeah, because it's difficult. They're trying for getting their own uh, small sachet. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So life in Ghana is it's, it's hard for the uh, average uh, person. Uh, uh, those who don't have money. Yeah, yeah. The poor people. The poor the people, people, yeah. Even a uh, poor people cannot afford to, to buy to even buy like Saudi. Yeah. yeah. Only the okay, the people, the people have, have a bit more money, yeah. but the average Ghanaian, a lot of these things they can't they buy, they can't afford to buy them. Okay, and what's your name? I'm Mrs. Kwanza. Mrs. Kwanza, this is Mr. Kwanza's wife, very lovely lady. So she sells all these local provisions, and we've got some soft drinks as well. So, Mr. Kwanza, how are you? I'm fine. Yeah, are you retired? Yeah, I'm retired. What were I you retired. doing before? I was with education. Oh, in education, I, okay. I taught for 37 years. Oh, wow. And I retired for about 11 years ago. Okay. okay. And how is retirement in so, Ghana? <laughs> is it okay? Are you what? relaxing? You are still relaxing, but we are not getting, so we keep on asking. Yeah, yeah. So there's going to be like an election coming up soon, next month. How do you feel about the election? Oh, the election, I, I, I'm praying. Yes. Hello. You're I'm praying, praying yes. Maybe the MPP can win and then change the okay. system. Because right. the system in which we are now is really very, it's very, very, very is it difficult? Ah, it's difficult and oh. Yeah. You can't even express it. Wow. <laughs> so MPP is the opposition party. Yeah. And yeah. we have NDC who is currently in government. Yeah. So you're the hoping NDC. that the opposition will come in and change yeah, that's things. Right. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Which So this is the small portion where, um, hey, how am I going to get up here? <laughs> okay. Mommy, come and hold me. Let me try and get up this little mountain. Oh, ah, there you go. So this is a small portion that Mohammed has. And this is where he grows his... What does he grow here? What do you grow? Cassava and... Do you have anything that is grown already? No. Or you just started? Just started. Okay. So you have to weed here? Yeah. Is that broad here? Is that... Uh, is there any broad here on it? Is there some? Let's go and have a look. So, um, there you go, guys. This is what it actually looks like on the tree. So... It grows with these really big leaves and then that's the actual uh, fruit the lighting is not very good mm. yeah any more yeah. it's all along this little this is the road that leads to my um, cousin's house aha uh -huh, there you are yeah so yeah it's it's very common in Ghana isn't it Mohammed no, yes, yes. Everywhere you yeah. get it. Cool. So Mohammed is going to weed. So in Ghana they use um, uh, machet. Machet or hatchet? Machet. Machete. Machete. So as you can see, he's just like clearing the place. Because there's like a lot of weeds. It's very physical work, as you can see. You have to be really strong. And that machete is really, really sharp. 
uh, or do. How do you say in Cree, Mohammed? Or do. Or do now. How do you say? Uh, or do, meaning he's kind of clearing the place. Farming. So this is how it's been done for many years. There's no really main kind of um, heavy machinery. It's all just like hard labour. And this is a plot of land. This is how land is sold in Ghana. So it's normally like, I don't know how much acres a plot is. But this is like a typical plot that if it's sold to you, it will come in this form. And then you would have to then um, get the ground ready, level it, fill it. And then you start your concrete work gradually. And then, yeah, you will um, start building. So, yeah, this is probably somebody's um, land. And what they do is they get like a caretaker like Mohammed like this and he'll take care of it in the person's absence. So they'll be clearing it because Ghana is a very tropical country. So there's obviously a lot of sun, a lot of rain. And uh, yeah, the, the weeds and the vegetation grow really quickly. So he's cutting the um, stick that I showed you earlier. And I think that's what he's going to put in the ground to start the growth of the cassava. Is it cassava you're growing? Yeah, cassava. Yeah, he's growing cassava, which is what we... He has to cut them into pieces. So, yeah. So, I'm going to leave him to get on with it because it's very hot. Seriously. <laughs> I might... Yeah. And here we have some local people walking with their This I'm going to say I'm going to put it in my film I'm going to put it in my film Hello What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? Meat pie Meat pie What do you say? What do you say? Now meat pie, but I could say one CD. One CD. Why now we here? Ah, okay. Me a small video. Now we the quite briefly. Your friend say Joyce. Joyce. Hello, Joyce. Who's where? Bismarck. Bismarck. Ubani. Ah. Now, you might to say what Ghana. We be fun as ah, and yeah, easy, but we we'll manage it. Ah, no moto, no moto pie no. Hey, ah, to the whole day we be nancy. Into most most start the time bang. I know pa by six now I start it. Now I pong time bang. Hey, seven o'clock. Hey, what did she? Ah, around area, you know. Into by seven o'clock now we do fee. Now I'm at Tony Nina. Ah, into at that call, when you say, in Faso. Mhm. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, mm. Okay. Your choice, me da se. Nyame shira why? Na nyame nkosi ma why? Yo. So yeah, that was um, a local seller. So I'm trying to get a good view. Yeah, that's good. Why should she omo? Into met me at na ha. Aha. Sorry, let me just pause. Yeah, so sorry, it's gone really hot. Um, yeah, so that lady was um, a local seller of uh, meat pies. She makes them herself. And then what she does, sorry, my tree's not that brilliant. Um, but yeah, definitely between three to five pounds she makes a day for 12 hours work in the heat. That's a lot. <laughs> I just walked from the gate to literally next door and look at me, I'm sweating. 
So can you imagine me with meat pie on top of my head? <laughs> Walking for 12 hours. It's, it's not an easy life. And as the lady who sells the um, provisions next door said, you know, it's not easy for the average Ghanaian at all. Um, cost of living is really high. And her husband, um, like he said, he's retired now. So they've opened that little shop as a means of, um, you know, trying to basically make a living. But like I said, this area is very, very new. Um, it's a new area, new residential area. And um, there's not really a lot of people around. And the few that are around have probably gone to work. So you can imagine, it's not like Sainsbury's or your typical corner shop in England. You know, they're just probably just about getting by. So yeah, a little bit of insight into my local area. That was quite nice. Anywhere you go, London, USA.